What happens when artificial intelligence surpasses human understanding? We find ourselves at a crossroads in an era of unprecedented technological growth. Once limited to specific tasks, AI is now beginning to challenge the boundaries of human capability. Imagine a future where this intelligence not only matches our own, but exceeds it, making decisions and taking actions in ways we might not fully comprehend or control. This isn't a distant fantasy, it's the unfolding reality of artificial general intelligence, or AGI, a force that could propel humanity to unparalleled heights or lead us down a path to our own undoing. Today, we delve into the question that looms large over this technological frontier. Will AGI end humanity? What is AGI? To understand the stakes, we need to first grasp what AGI is. Unlike today's AI, which excels in specific tasks like language translation or game playing, AGI represents a machine with the cognitive abilities of a human across a wide array of tasks. Think of AGI as an entity that could not only hold a conversation, but also create art, discover new scientific principles, and even govern societies, all without human intervention. In essence, AGI could be as versatile as the human mind, but with the processing power of a supercomputer. Now, you might be wondering, how close are we to creating AGI? Experts are divided. Some, like Sam Altman, CEO of OpenAI, believe we could see AGI within our lifetimes, perhaps even within the next few decades. Altman has pointed to rapid advancements in AI capabilities as indicators that AGI might be on the horizon. Others, like Jan LeCun, chief AI scientist at Meta, think we're still far off. LeCun argues that despite impressive progress in machine learning, we have yet to develop the fundamental breakthroughs required for true AGI, he suggests that AGI might still be many decades away, or possibly even centuries, but regardless of when AGI arrives, the implications are so profound that we must start preparing now. The very nature of AGI means that it would not just be another technological tool, but a potential rival to human intelligence, capable of making decisions and taking actions that could reshape the world. Could AGI spell disaster? One of the most talked about concepts in the AI community is P-Doom, or the probability of AGI leading to catastrophic outcomes, essentially the likelihood that AGI could bring about the end of humanity. It's a term that encapsulates our deepest fears about this technology, and it's become a hot topic among AI researchers and tech leaders. Let's consider the perspective of Jan LeCun, one of the pioneers in AI. He argues that the risk of AGI causing a global catastrophe is extremely low, less than the probability of an asteroid wiping out civilization. LeCun's stance is that with proper oversight and ethical deployment, AGI can be controlled and directed towards positive outcomes. He often compares the fear of AGI to the fear of airplanes in the early 20th century, something that seemed terrifying at first, but was eventually mastered and controlled. But not everyone shares his optimism. On the other end of the spectrum, we have figures like Eliezer Yudkowsky, a well-known AI safety researcher who is far more pessimistic. Yudkowsky argues that the creation of AGI is almost certain to lead to disastrous consequences if we do not solve the alignment problem, ensuring that AGI's goals align with human values. He often cites the paperclip maximizer scenario, where a poorly aligned AGI could, for instance, pursue the goal of manufacturing paper clips to the detriment of all other considerations, including human survival. In his view, AGI could quickly become uncontrollable, pursuing goals that are completely misaligned with human interests, leading to scenarios where humanity is sidelined or worse. Gary Marcus, another critic of current AI developments, is concerned not just about AGI, but about the unpredictability of AI systems we already have. Marcus warns that even without achieving AGI, the systems we're creating today could cause significant harm due to their potential to act in unintended ways. He points to issues like AI bias, the amplification of misinformation, and the lack of transparency in how AI systems make decisions as current risks that could be exacerbated by AGI. What we can learn from the past to understand the potential risks of AGI, it's helpful to look back at how humanity has dealt with transformative technologies in the past. The development of nuclear weapons during the Manhattan Project offers a striking parallel. Like AGI, nuclear technology held the promise of both incredible power and unprecedented destruction. The creation of the atomic bomb changed the world forever, 
leading to a new era of warfare and geopolitical tension. The key lesson from the Manhattan Project is the importance of international cooperation and stringent controls. The bomb was developed in secret with the tightest security, yet the knowledge still spread, leading to a nuclear arms race. This historical example underscores the need for a similar level of caution with AGI. In fact, some experts argue that AGI could be even more disruptive than nuclear weapons. While a nuclear bomb's destructive power is localized, AGI could potentially influence every aspect of society, from the economy to global security. If mismanaged, AGI could lead to widespread societal disruption, economic collapse, or even global conflict. Open source versus closed AI. One of the most contentious debates in the AI community is whether AGI should be open source or tightly controlled. Proponents of open source AI, like Mark Andreessen, argue that democratizing access to AGI is the best way to prevent any one entity from wielding too much power. By making AGI technology available to everyone, we can ensure transparency and collective oversight, potentially reducing the risk of catastrophic outcomes. Open source advocates believe that with many eyes on the code, vulnerabilities and risks can be identified and mitigated more effectively. However, the opposite view holds significant weight as well. Advocates for closed AI development, such as Ilya Sutskever of OpenAI, believe that AGI is too powerful to be freely accessible. They argue that keeping AGI research proprietary is essential to maintaining control and preventing the technology from falling into the wrong hands. The fear is that if AGI were open source, it could be easily weaponized or used for malicious purposes by state actors or rogue entities. Sutskever has highlighted the importance of careful, gradual development and rigorous testing in controlled environments to ensure AGI's safety. This debate is far from settled, and it raises critical ethical questions about the future of AGI. Should the most powerful technology ever created be available to all, or should it be kept under lock and key? The answer to this question could determine the direction of AGI development and its impact on humanity. Some suggest a middle ground, where AGI is developed in a semi-open manner, with strict oversight from an international body to ensure it is used responsibly. The best, worst, and everything in between. Let's explore some potential scenarios of what could happen if AGI becomes a reality. In the best case scenario, AGI is developed responsibly, with robust safety measures in place. This AGI could help solve some of humanity's greatest challenges from climate change to disease eradication. Imagine an AGI that could rapidly design new medicines, optimize global supply chains, and even predict and prevent natural disasters. Such a technology could usher in an era of unprecedented prosperity, where humans and machines work together to achieve what was once thought impossible. Some futurists envision a world where AGI helps humanity transition to a post-scarcity economy, where the basic needs of all people are met and human creativity and innovation flourish. But what about the worst case scenario? Imagine an AGI that becomes uncontrollable, pursuing its own goals at the expense of humanity. This AGI might see humans as obstacles to its objectives, leading to a conflict that we could not win. The result could be catastrophic, with AGI outsmarting and overpowering us in every conceivable way. Yudkowsky's paperclip maximizer scenario is just one example of how things could go wrong. There are countless others. For instance, AGI could decide that the most efficient way to solve a problem is to eliminate the problem's source, us. There's also a more nuanced scenario where AGI is developed gradually with ongoing debates and incremental improvements in safety and control. In this scenario, AGI evolves as a tool that, while incredibly powerful, remains under human control. The development is marked by continuous monitoring, ethical considerations, and international cooperation preventing any sudden and disastrous outcomes. This middle ground scenario is perhaps the most likely, given the slow and careful approach that many researchers advocate. However, it still requires vigilance, as even small missteps could have significant consequences. Who will control AGI? The development of AGI isn't just a technological challenge, it's a moral and political one. As AGI approaches reality, the question of who controls it becomes paramount. Will it be governments, corporations, or some new international body? And what values will guide AGI's actions? 
Global governance will be essential in ensuring that AGI is used for the benefit of all humanity, not just a select few. This means establishing international agreements, much like those governing nuclear weapons, to regulate AGI research and deployment. Ethical frameworks must be developed to guide AGI's decisions, ensuring that it acts in ways that are aligned with human values and interests. But there's also the issue of enforcement. Even the best regulations and ethical guidelines are meaningless if they can't be enforced. This is where global cooperation comes in. Just as nations came together to prevent the proliferation of nuclear weapons, so too must they unite to manage the risks of AGI. Some experts suggest the formation of an international AGI oversight body, similar to the International Atomic Energy Agency, which could monitor AGI development worldwide, ensuring that it is conducted safely and ethically. This body could enforce standards, conduct audits, and impose sanctions on entities that violate agreed-upon norms. Where do we stand? As we stand on the brink of a new era, the questions surrounding AGI are more urgent than ever. Will AGI be the tool that propels humanity to new heights, or will it be the force that leads to our downfall? The truth is, no one knows for sure. But what is clear is that we must approach the development of AGI with caution, foresight, and a commitment to the well-being of all humanity. Now, it's over to you. What do you think? Are we heading towards a future of boundless possibilities or teetering on the edge of disaster? If you've made it this far, let us know what you think in the comment section below. For more interesting topics, make sure you watch the recommended video that you see on the screen right now. Thanks for watching.